Mom. Hey everybody, it is Dave coming to you from Los Angeles, Ontario Airport. So this is a very exciting day for me because it is the day that I secretly am flying to Manila to surprise my Filipina girlfriend in time for her birthday. So my girlfriend Abby thinks that I will be coming to Manila next week and she's all excited to meet me at the airport but I'm gonna have to let her down a little bit and come a bit early and surprise her and catch her reaction. I don't think she'll mind. I think she'll be very happy actually, let's hope. So Abby, my girlfriend and I have not seen each other in person for about one year now. We've been long distance for that long, just been video chatting a lot. So yeah, we're both very ready to see each other again. She keeps telling me how excited she is and that uh, she wished I was coming earlier than I was. So yeah, this will be her birthday present to be like, yeah, you got your wish. I came early. All right, but uh, yeah, enough chatting to the camera right now. Let's do the thing. So I actually started today's journey at the Seattle airport and I was gonna start my vlog there, but it, it, it kind of got crazy there for a minute. So I decided to start it here in this airport, Los Angeles, Ontario, where it's uh, much quieter and uh, much less busy. Which brings me to say, I really appreciate uh, international flights to Asia now flying out of LA, Ontario, because I like this airport a whole lot better than I like LAX. So because this is such a long journey, I think it's gonna be 20 plus hours, 20 to 25 hours, I don't even know. It, I, I'm just trying not to think about how long it's gonna be. But because this is gonna be such a long flight day, I had to come up with an excuse for Abby uh, to be out of cell phone range. So what I told her is that uh, me and my friend George uh, were going camping off grid and that I wouldn't be able to uh, contact her for the next 24 hours. So she shouldn't be expecting any messages from me while I am in the air. Somehow I made a rookie mistake and ended up in a middle seat. This is gonna be a really long flight. For you, Abby. So here I am in the final transfer point for my uh, flight to Manila. This is the Taipei International Airport. It's a really nice one, but it is humid in here. I can't do a thing with my hair. And I wish it was easier to get from point to point because this is a very long terminal to walk down. Anyway, so I have a couple hours layover. Why don't I tell you about how Abby and I met? So as I said before, it was last year and I was working for a tech startup that wanted to open up an office in Manila and they chose me to um, manage that project and sent me to Manila. So I lived there for about five months and in the meantime, I joined a gym and uh, Abby also happened to be a member of that gym. So that is how we met. Abby saw me first at the gym. I was on the treadmill and she thought I was really fast, so she nicknamed me Flash. That's how we met. She might have a slightly different story about it, but uh, maybe I'll let her tell her side of that once I get there. So after we met at the gym, we just started dating. Uh, saw each other a couple times a week. You know, we were both working. We'd meet up in the evenings and weekends. So yeah, it just grew from there. It turned into a purely long distance relationship because I had to fly back to the States to do other work, and it's been about a year since we've seen each other, so it is about time. All right, let's hop on the flight to Manila. Oh, 
All right, finally, after so many hours of travel, I lost count, I've made it to Manila. Merry Christmas. So next plan of action is to get to my hotel. Oh my gosh, I am so happy to finally be in my hotel room. I cannot wait to take a shower. But first, let's go over the game plan. It has just turned afternoon here in Manila. I will not be surprising Abby until this evening. And the reason for that is because she has an exam coming up later this afternoon that if she passes will hopefully uh, advance her career a little bit. So instead of surprising her beforehand and making her mind go everywhere, I want her to focus on that first and then surprise her and hopefully make her really happy. So I've got some time to shower and rest a little bit and uh, uh, make myself smell better. All right, the time is approaching to go surprise my girlfriend, Abby. So I decided to go with the shirt that Abby gave me for my birthday. She says it would do well in the Philippines because it's nice and cooling. And so far I'm in agreement with her. One thing I'll do when I approach the place is wear this hat to try to cover my face because they do have CCTV. If she decides to look at the CCTV before opening the door, uh, that might ruin the surprise a little bit. So yeah. And to finish it off by smelling good, I'm gonna wear uh, this cologne by Versace. Uh, this is Abby's favorite to smell on me. She absolutely loves it. All right, let's go surprise the girlfriend. So what I told Abby is that I am getting a gift delivered to her at her home. So this is what she's expecting. She's not expecting me though. Grab just dropped me off and I'm at her place and I'm gonna go knock. Here we go. She's expecting a knock, so there's that. Hello, mom, sir. Delivery. She's coming, she's coming. Mom? Hi. Happy birthday. I'm here! What? I thought it's on Saturday! Yeah, it was, but not anymore. Wake up! <laughs> Hello! Oh my gosh! Hi! Grab it! I'm my I thought it's on Saturday! Not anymore. Can I come in? Yes. Okay! Good. <laughs> she surprised you. Are you surprised? Yes. Yay! It works. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I thought you were in camping trip. <laughs> it was some camping trip. I'll tell you what. I was camping out in a plane all day. <laughs> You're happy, right? Yes. Oh, okay. You're just surprised. Okay. <laughs> That was the point. <laughs> Hello! Judai, how are you doing? I'm doing good! <laughs> I wanted to film her reaction. Oh, these are for you, by the way. Oh, thank you. Thank <laughs> you! how are you, Dave? I'm well, thank you. How are you, Tita Len? I know! That We're planning a no. to be Jodiano. Oh, welcome, welcome, welcome home. He's also planning. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God! Lots of surprises today. <laughs> Lots of surprises. What's the other surprise? Huh? What's but the here. other? <laughs> oh, surprise! 
And you passed the test? Yes, I passed the test. Awesome. Almost got perfect score. <laughs> Amazing. I knew you could do it. <laughs> I'm traveling. <laughs> Bella. That's Bella, yeah. He's super happy and thrilled that I'm here. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> Can't believe it. <laughs> Best gift ever. <laughs> oh, yeah. Best gift ever. Y'all heard it. Mm -hmm. Go figure, I'm offered food once I get here. <laughs> there's sinigang. There's it's Abby's favorite. And also one of my favorite Filipino foods. <laughs> so that was so much fun for me to pull off. Did you have fun, Abby? Of course. It was so awesome to see you. I did not expect you at that day. Well, I'm so glad that I could pull it off, and I'm so thankful for you watching us and uh, being a little part of our special moment there. So now I want to let you guys know what's coming up on this channel very soon. So, Abby and I, we are going to be taking a big adventure around the Philippines, and it's going to be in a lot of places that's off the normal tourist track of the Philippines, so you don't want to miss it. It's going to be places like Misamis Oriental, Cagayan de Oro, Catanduanes, Bicol, Pangasinan, Baguio, Banaue, Sagada, Cavite, Sargao. <laughs> that one's not so off the tourist track, but I, I think we might be able to find some hidden gems to show you guys. So be sure you're subscribed and hit the notification bell so you don't miss any of them that are coming up. It's going to be so exciting. I can't wait to show you guys. Thank you again. Good night. We're Good really night. tired. <laughs> Then you can cover it with feelings. <laughs> mm -hmm. Back straight. Mm. Awesome.